Also have an FA Youth Cup quarter-final to come after that astonishing comeback against Liverpool that you may have seen with us on the fifth standout. 3-0 down with 20 minutes to play. 4-3 winners in stoppage time. Alone in France, and there's Marcus Alonso, who's... Future is always the, the subject of some questioning, but in terms of... Full match in there, he read that pass. He's the youth team's top scorer this season, Mothersill. 14 goals he's got. It's normally him up top that they brought in soon. We got away with it on a couple of occasions there. Brilliant from uh, Oyadeli. But he stutter! Well, that's a big chance, isn't it? What a ball in. Good game, you, this. You, it is. When he plays left wing back, always, he always reminds me of Andy Robertson of Liverpool. When he plays uh, yeah. in midfield, well, a cover. And uh, another reverse for Andy Myers' group. They've been uh, losing a few lately, but that one will have hurt. Further, and, and Murray is sort of coming up on the overlap, so we've just got to be aware of that. And Garnacho's in again here, and this time he has scored third. I said before, he just seems to be tucking in a little bit more at the moment, and he's finding those little spots. Little Both ends when this Ed Brown side plays, and more often than not, the majority of them are at the right end. More like Jimmy Grees in that position. And you say Jimmy Grees wouldn't, wouldn't even have thought about passing there. And Kerry wouldn't as well, so, you know, Ozzy... Yeah. Two seconds flat, and... You know, tough for anyone to get up, even a 18-year-old footballer, never mind a middle-aged man. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not expecting him. Wouldn't be expecting him to get there, to be honest, the referee. No, but that, don't that, guess. That's, that's not a fault. Yeah, it's the, it's, the, it's the getting the decisions correct that we all want. And he's got that wrong on both accounts. And Billy G is going to have to... Because this is a fast-paced game. There's another free kick here from the Abu Fowl. Billy G is going to... He gets caught here, uh, Abu. I mean, he thinks he's won the ball there, then he loses it, then he loses his rag. And you can't foul anyone in from that situation. However, it's not such a bad thing to pass as well, as long as we get our shot away and maybe score. It's a the mother still has blasted through. And he went for the shot that time. Maynard with the block, it's a corner. You know what, he's put in so many crosses, has lost his foot in, still gets the shot away. Does well here. Really good play. Just, just seems stuttered just before he went. The managers always ask for teams to be more clinical, perhaps, which is something we haven't been so far today. Certainly have got that ability to do that. Well, lots of modern training techniques nowadays that are nothing like they used to be. But uh, play to the whistle is one that remains for Brody Hughes. For sure. uh, Charlie Webster found that to his cost. All well, partiality aside, I resent the fact that those challenges, are, just in football in general, are always given as penalties now. Does he actually foul? Back in this game, then an offensive one. I don't know if that's because he is a throwback or just because of the game situation, I suspect. Cleared by Stutter. Hughes, Hall, Webster. Cut out by Billy G. For the side, not only winning the ball back, but just making the right decisions. It's a good take that from Mather and the United. What a game. He, he, he's been terrific in midfield, Charlie Webster. Flower was involved winning the ball there. Malik Mothersill for once has lost it. 